This program is brought to you by Emory University. This uh, next award means a lot to me to be able to present <clears throat> because over the last 20 years uh, I've been a lot, through a lot, uh, with this um, incredible human being. So a few weeks ago, Emory announced a new research collaboration with Pfizer to advance the discovery of antiviral agents for COVID-19. As COVID-19 con continues to evolve and impact the lives of people around the world, the need for additional effective treatment options continues to be at the forefront of global efforts to combat the disease. Emory announced that it has entered into an agreement with Pfizer to advance research that may serve to help address this need and potentially save patients' lives. Under the terms of the research collaboration, option, and license agreement, Emory University's Shinazi Laboratory, led by distinguished researcher Raymond Shinazi and Pfizer, will work together to identify and evaluate potential antiviral compounds for the treatment of COVID-19. As part of the collaboration, Pfizer will provide funding to the Shinazi Group and collaborate on research to advance the preclinical development of these compounds. If successful, not if successful, when successful, Pfizer will have the option to exercise the exclusive rights to the leading clinical candidates and be solely responsible for further development activities. Over the years, Dr. Raymond Shinazi's research has led to advancements in life-saving treatments for, and, and, and don't try to count them all, HIV, hepatitis B, hepatitis C, and COVID-19. Dr. Shinazi's understanding of the drug development process from discovery through development, clinical research, and treatment truly sets him apart from his peers. It has been an incredible experience for my team in OTT to learn from Ray over the years. He has been instrumental in shaping our experience and understanding in not only how technology transfer can work, but its enormous potential to save lives, and he has saved a lot of lives. I want to personally thank and recognize Dr. Shinazi and his team for being such great partners throughout the years, as well as for their dedication to saving lives. Laura Fritz in my office worked very hard and was instrumental as she led this negotiation for Emory. We are appreciative of our partners at Pfizer for working so hard to get this deal done quickly, um, even though it didn't always feel like it was quickly um, in the grand scheme of things. It was pretty quickly um, so that the research could begin. Please join me in recognizing Dr. Raymond Shinazi, Dr. Frank Ambler, Dr. Mahesh Kasturi, Dr. Long Hu Zhao, Dr. Zi Chen, and Dr. Hong Wang Zhang for receiving the Deal of the Year Award. Yeah, thank you very much, Todd. Uh, you've come a long way. OTT has come a long way from the days where they had a little trailer somewhere not far from here, and uh, with two or three people uh, working at Vince Latours and some of the other people you know. It's remarkable how far we've come at Emory over the years. I've been this year. I will celebrate my 45th year. Hopefully, I still look young. And, uh, <laughs> And I've got a young wife too, so that helps, and a young friends too. So I think it's great to be here. It's a great honor. I'm sorry I wasn't able to come last year. It's nice to have, a, maybe it's a record, I don't know, deal of the year twice in, in, one, in, one, in two years. Uh, that's pretty good, I think. And it's a big honor to get it from Todd. And I cannot uh, thank enough Laura for her hard work. I had to do my usual, which is to push a little bit to get things done. But uh, the deal get, did get done uh, last week of December. It wasn't much fun to, to do it, but uh, there were threats of not closing the deal in time, but we did it. It's a deal really, it's, it's fantastic because we already have uh, a lead, what we consider as lead compounds. And now we have to convince the company that uh, we indeed have these, they are indeed leads. It takes time for them to realize what we have, the treasure we have here at Emory. And as you know, we two more than three years ago, we started probably the first uh, COVID lab at Emory, very first one. 
we carried, we basically got the virus from NIH and started working immediately on it. And we worked on trying to find drugs. And of course, we focused our energy on the low hanging fruit, which was basically inflammation. Although at the time, people didn't realize it's a two part disease one is the virus, and one is inflammation. And what happened after that is, uh, you know, the drug now, paracetamol, is the only approved drug, fully approved drug, by the US FDA for COVID, which has saved many, many lives all over the world. So we're very proud of this. And some of the studies were conducted by Vince Marconi here at Emory. So we've done an, an amazing job in record time. And we hope we can do the same thing here. But I think I would be, the, 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 I want to say that this is not just me. It's about also the team behind me. I have a tremendous team in front of me and behind me that are helping me uh, carve new postures and new areas and new opportunities. And uh, we're not finished. We have a few more viruses to conquer. But uh, I think we're on our way, well on our way to find some amazing drugs for COVID when it emerges. And I want to thank particularly my team behind me, especially uh, Frank Omblar, who led the chemistry team that led to the discovery of uh, these two classes of compounds that we have in our lab that are quite phenomenal. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.